in a demonstration of enduring diplomatic relations and international cooperation, the government of St. Lucia has once again received a supply of fertilizer from the Kingdom of Morocco. This cooperative gesture provided annually aims to address soil fertility challenges and elevate crop production across the nation. A consignment of 3,975 bags of fertilizer was handed over this year as a platform of government officials, agriculture sector representatives and stakeholders united in acknowledging the significance of international partnerships in advancing sustainable development goals. Minister Consular of the Kingdom of Morocco in St. Lucia, Abdel Qadam Madawi, says the collaboration between the two nations extends beyond material assistance, signifying a shared commitment to progress and underscoring the value of working together to overcome common challenges and promote agricultural sustainability. I hope the relationship between Morocco and St. Lucia will not be only bilateral, it should go further than this, than this it will be multilateral, including Morocco, St. Lucia, or other African countries. According to the Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, Honorable Alfred Prosper, farmers form the backbone of the nation's food security and economic growth and will stand to benefit from this benevolent gesture as the fertilizer will be distributed to them free of charge. Honorable Minister Prosper expressed his deepest appreciation to the Kingdom of Morocco for its continued support in fortifying St. Lucia's agriculture sector and fostering a brighter future for its citizens. So I'm very happy today to receive on behalf of the government of St. Lucia 3,975 bags of fertilizer that would go to the farmers free of charge. You would recall, as um, mentioned by Honorable Alpha Baptiste, if you were to put a cost to this fertilizer, a cost to the shipping, and all what it takes to get the fertilizer here, I'm sure you would be speaking thousands of dollars that we are now giving to the farmers to support them and to help in terms of increasing our food security, securing our food and nutrition security. The 25 by 25 target is expected to be achieved in the next two years. We must, as a government, we must, as a ministry, play a significant role in ensuring that we achieve that 25 by 25 target. And this is one way of contributing to this. As both nations look forward to a future of shared growth and prosperity, the government of St. Lucia reiterates its dedication to nurturing and strengthening diplomatic ties in effecting positive change on a national scale. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.